When I was little, like in elementary school, I used to want to say, I want to be a neurosurgeon because I started watching a lot of Discovery Health Channel and during dinner time, I used to put on the grossest brain surgeries and my parents are like, oh, turn that off, turn that off. I came here when I was two with um, my parents and my older brother and my younger brother and we lived in the Dominican Republic for a while. They took us to the United States so that we could really, you know, be whatever we wanted to be and kind of live out that American dream. I started research my first semester at UCF. We were doing stem cell research in regards to um, heart attacks. So right now I'm working at Dr. Teeter's Bacterial Toxin Lab. We're trying to find different cures of cancer drugs that are already FDA approved to see how they can affect intoxication, you know, when somebody gets cholera, for example. I definitely like to think that, you know, at the end of the day, if we do discover something, then we'll be able to help a lot of people. You know, UCF is a giant university. It's one of the largest in the nation. But at the same time, they have the Honors College, so you get the community. Because we have small classes, you're really given the opportunity to get to know your professor. And, you know, they get to know your name, they ask you questions, you can ask them questions after class, and they'll sit with you for hours and just talking about the most interesting things. The most memorable activity that I've encountered so far at the Honors College was the President Scholars Program. It was four weeks in the classroom and two weeks in the Caribbean and we learned so much. We ended up donating the, the supplies that we had brought to uh, a home for the elderly and then we also volunteered there. We spent some time with them. Um, I had had some EMT training in the past so I took blood pressure and we gave them their medication. It was really great because I don't think that they always had somebody there to really listen to them for so long. In the next a uh, couple months I'm going to finish applying to medical school and I hope to get into one of my top five schools, UCF being one of them. Hopefully I'll get an acceptance letter in the mail and you know I plan to finish my MD degree and then later on um, I hope to join Doctors Without Borders. You know a doctor is not just somebody who helps somebody at a hospital or at your practice. You really go out into the world and find those who really need it. I'm Jacqueline Boehm. I'm a senior at UCF and I'm a molecular and microbiology major.